Larsa Pippen and Marcus Jordan are sparking breakup rumors. Do you remember back in July 2023 when Michael Jordan was asked about Marcus and Larsa Pippen being together? And he straight up said no. Hey, Mr. Jordan, what do you think about Marcus and Larsa Pippen together? You approve of it? No. You don't approve? That had to be awkward for Larsa, who had just claimed that Michael Jordan and the whole family were cool with their relationship. It's like, oops, not really. Turns out Michael Jordan wasn't on board at all. Rumor has it, he's over the moon now that their relationship is done. You know, Larsa talking about how everyone was fine with it and parents just want to see their kids happy, but now it seems like maybe it wasn't as rosy as she made it sound. People were saying she wanted a Jordan baby to secure part of Marcus's inheritance. Well, turns out Michael Jordan might have had similar thoughts. So spill the tea. What was the real deal behind Marcus and Larsa breaking up? Once we realized our families were okay with it, then I feel like that was easier for us. Just to give you a bit of context, Marcus and Larza started their journey into romance in September 2022. But Larza, in an attempt to keep things under wraps, initially dismissed their connection, claiming they were just good friends. It all seemed like a big charade. Despite their chemistry, which they tried to deny, by November 2022, Larza was celebrating Thanksgiving with the Jordan family, and they finally admitted they were an item. Right from the start, a lot of folks weren't on board with this relationship, especially considering Larza's track record and the rumors that she might be pushing things a bit too much. There were reports of one date where Larza was apparently getting quite handsy in a loud club, but Marcus wasn't reciprocating the affection. People online were also buzzing about their significant age difference and the complicated family ties, given that Larza's ex-husband, Scotty Pippen, was a teammate of Michael Jordan's in the 90s. What makes it even more surreal is the fact that Marcus was practically a baby when Larza was married to Scotty, and they were all chill with Michael Jordan back then. It's not just about the age gap. It's about Larza watching Marcus grow up. And if that wasn't enough, as soon as they made their relationship official, pictures surfaced of Marcus locking lips with another woman outside his home. There's even video footage of him sharing a steamy embrace with someone else. But the weirdness doesn't end there. Larsa admitted to snooping through Marcus's phone quite a bit, and she casually mentioned to the entire world that they hooked up five times every night, which is just an odd thing to share. Apart from Michael Jordan, others like former NBA player Jalen Rose, weren't approving either, suggesting that Larza should treat Marcus more like a nephew than a partner, emphasizing that certain relationships used to be off-limits. And Larza seems to be quite carefree about Scotty's opinion on her relationship. When asked about what Scotty thinks about her friendship with Marcus, she casually responded that she doesn't know, and it has never been brought up. The kids haven't mentioned it bothering their dad either, but the truth is, it did bother Daddy Scotty, much like it bothered Michael Jordan. I bet Scotty is relieved now that it's over. Um, has Marcus reached out to you? Everyone you, are, you are, you are good, Devin. I'll, I'll get it. Everyone wants to know, how do you feel about the relationship? Okay, shut up for me. I need to change. The rumors of a breakup between Larza and Marcus started circulating when Larza unfollowed Marcus on Instagram and deleted all their pictures together. She posted a poll asking if friends should unfollow their exes, shared a video about trusting your inner voice, and posted a quote on choosing partners wisely. Deepening the mystery surrounding Larza Pippen and Marcus Jordan's apparent breakup are reports suggesting that the primary cause of their split revolves around conflicting desires regarding having children intensified by their considerable 16-year age difference. News of their separation surfaced when Larza unfollowed Marcus on Instagram and shared a cryptic post alluding to an ex-partner. The posted message read, The man you choose to be your partner affects everything in your life, your mental health, your peace of mind, your love inside you, your happiness, how you get through tragedies, your successes, how your children will be raised, and much more. Choose wisely. Despite neither Larza Pippen nor Marcus Jordan publicly confirming the breakup, insider accounts suggest that differences in their perspectives on starting a family and divergent visions for their future played pivotal roles in dissolving their relationship. They were in love with each other, but once the honeymoon phase ended, they started to realize their priorities differed, revealed a source to DailyMail.com. 
Their age difference played a major factor in the split, and on top of the fact that Marcus wants to have kids while she wants to be more of a celebrity. The source continued shedding light on the contrasting ideas each held about their future family. They both had different ideas of what their family was going to be like, and that built lots of stress. They are just on different roads, but they are both to blame for not being together, even though they are blaming each other for the demise. While a potential reconciliation might exist in the future, current indications suggest a precarious situation with significant disagreements posing obstacles to any immediate resolution. Intriguingly, Michael Jordan's influence emerges as a significant factor hindering their ability to remain together. The complexities of their relationship dynamics underscore the challenges faced by celebrities in navigating personal choices, priorities, and the public scrutiny that often accompanies their romantic endeavors. Media Takeout reached out to a producer of The Real Housewives of Miami to spill more details on the situation. According to the producer, Larsa needs someone more mature and financially stable. While Marcus was fun, Larsa is apparently looking for a life partner. Another source mentioned that they decided to take some time apart for personal growth, emphasizing that it wasn't due to family input. However, multiple sources have reported that Larza and Marcus are taking a break because of tensions in their relationship, possibly exacerbated by Michael Jordan's public disapproval. An insider suggested that the history between Michael and Scotty added complications, even though Larza and Marcus tried to downplay it. Michael being Marcus's dad and Scotty being the father of Larza's children made things complex. For context, there's a history of tension between Scottie Pippen and Michael Jordan. In Scottie's memoir, Unguarded, he expressed disappointment that Michael didn't give enough recognition to their NBA history in The Last Dance documentary. Scottie claimed that Michael had editorial control and received $10 million for his role while the rest of the teammates didn't earn a dime. This history may have contributed to the strain on Larza and Marcus's relationship. Even Larsa had her own thoughts about how Scotty was portrayed in public. Scotty wasn't presented as positively as he should have been, in my opinion, considering he was a crucial part of the team. It's worth noting that around the time when rumors about her relationship with Marcus started circulating, she mentioned that she and Scotty were best friends and officially divorced, co-parenting amicably. Larza and Marcus haven't spoken about the exact reasons for their breakup, but sources close to the Jordans indicate that Michael is relieved the relationship is over. On social media, some people express that they didn't expect the relationship to last long. Now that they've split, there are questions about their joint podcast, Separation Anxiety, and how awkward it might be when they reunite for the second season of The Real Housewives of Miami. One fan even said, Larza has no business being with Marcus in the first place, not because of the age difference, but because she knew him when he was a child and her ex-husband used to be best friends with his father. Larza is a very selfish mother for messing around with her son's teammate, and if I was her, I would be embarrassed to know future song Gucci Flip Flops was allegedly about them messing around. Another fan said, how mature did she expect him to be? He's almost young enough to be her son. People say age is nothing but a number, but that is not true. It makes a difference in the maturity level of most people. There are some exceptions to the rule. This obviously was not one of them. Some older women may date younger men, but marrying them should be out of the question, especially if they are 30 and under. You're not evenly yoked with a man that's significantly younger than you are. Same can be said if it's a young woman marrying a man old enough to be her father or grandfather. I'm curious about your thoughts on the breakup. Do you believe Larsa was primarily interested in financial gain? And what's your overall opinion of Larsa choosing to date Marcus, given the history between her ex-husband and Michael Jordan? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. And while we wait for further updates, make sure to watch our other videos for more celebrity drama you never knew you needed.